This is Dave, the beat fan, Scandaliato, and since 1998, I've been the very proud owner of MeetThePotatoes.com. And I'm here right now to do the Wednesday, February the 5th, 2020, NCAA College Basketball Against the Spread Pickup Show. I'm just going to tackle one game on this program, game 829-830, that the Seton Hall Pirates, they're going to go on the road to play the Georgetown Hoyts. I'm going to give my against the spread wagering selection in this matchup for about three or four minutes or so. From now, but first up, you want to get to meet as number one play for Wednesday's basketball against the spread wagering action. It's $15. It's guaranteed to win. We're going to give you Thursday's number one play absolutely free. Text the word 1 O N E to 94253. Meatman has now won three straight number one plays. One on Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Ah! You want to get to one on Wednesday? The Meatman hit four straight. Number one plays. It's $15. This is my number one play of the day. You got a text word 1 O N E to 94253. Now, one on the Meatman's number one play for Wednesday's basketball against the spread wagering action over the phone. No problem. Cap, I got my own. Personal, toll free number that I'm literally gonna have it on the day I die. It's one eight three three meat man. That's how you talk directly with me. Las Vegas based professional handicap, but Dave Scan one eight three three meat man. This is my number one play of the day. My number one play of the day. It's fifteen dollars. It's guaranteed to win. Or I'm gonna give you the next day's number one play absolutely free. When you put the phone number, you type in 94253. When you put the text message, you put the word 1, O-N-E. It's that easy, Cap. Meet Man takes Venmo, Cash App, PayPal. Want to pay with your debit, your credit card. I send the invoice right to your email box. You never have to give the Meet Man your credit card information. Text the word 1, O-N-E to 942. Five, three, a couple of things you'll face. Make sure you subscribe to Dave Scandaliato's YouTube channel. That way you never miss any of the Meat Man's YouTube videos. Make sure you subscribe to Dave Scandaliato's YouTube channel. Now, you don't want to subscribe to Dave Scandaliato's YouTube channel. Hi, you cap. If you like watching the Meat Man's YouTube videos, hi, you brother. Just go to the homepage of my website. MeatandPotatoes.com. That is the internet home of Dave the Meat Man Scandaliano. W-W-W-dot-M-E-A-T-A-D-P-O-T-A-T-O-E-S dot C-O-M Meat and Potatoes dot com. Ah! Wednesday night NCAA college basketball. Get to see all pirates they're going to go on a road to play the Georgetown Hoyt. Ah! The Liners game at Chris Bookmaker, where the line originates, and over the seat all power, it's a one-and-a-half point road favorite. It's up to three. Seat all Pirates, open one-and-a-half on the road. It's up to three. Ah! I'm going to take Georgetown here. I'm going to go and take the Hoyts. Plus those... Three points. Now, a lot of people will probably say, Meat Man, <clears throat> you know, you were probably watching the State of the Union on Tuesday night, and, and, and he probably didn't see the, 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 the breaking news in college basketball at, that Mac McClug is doubtful for Georgetown on Wednesday night, and he's probably not going to play, and that's why the line went from one and a half to three. Because the Sharps and the Wise guys got a whole lot of information, and they moved the point spread a part and a half. Well, you got half of it right. Half of it. Half. One out of two. One out of two. Yes. I was watching the State of the Union. I like it. I'm a Trump guy. I'm not a Republican, okay? I'm not a Republican. I was kind of more of a Democrat up until a couple of years ago. But, man, it's tough to be a Democrat now. I mean, come on, Cap. Come on, Cap. It's embarrassing. 
It's embarrassing on that side. I mean, go on, now, look. Meat Man ain't no stinking Republican cap. I can hit it right now. I had a Republican with a man. I mean, what's going on over there? I mean, come on. I'm nothing like these people on that other side. I'm just not like them. Other than you, Chad, and you, Bruce. That's my two boys. Chad and Bruce, Cap, my two boys. Chad and Bruce. Ah! But the rest of them, ah, I don't get it. Ah, I don't get it. I can tell you another thing right now. Black men are going to vote for Donald Trump minimum 15%. Maybe even 20%. You heard it here first with a meat man. Black men are going to vote for Donald Trump 15 to 20%. And I'm going to tell you why. What does the Democrat Party have for black men? Nothing. Nothing. What are the top two? What are the top two things on a lot of the Democrat candidates' platform? Number one, climate change. I've never met a black man in my life. In my entire life, I talk to a black guy every day of my life that's ever said anything about no stinking climate change. Student loan debt. I don't know any black guys no student loan. Ah. I don't know any of them. Ah. Ain't nobody going to do nothing for you, Cap. I'm just telling you point blank. You ought to give it a shot. You ought to give it a shot. I'm going to tell you right now. Now, when Trump leaves, who knows who they're going to nominate next? Me, personally, I think it's going to be Nikki Haley, the ex-governor of South Carolina, and that she was a charge of the U.N. and all of that stuff. She was a United States representative of the U.N. I think Nikki Haley be after Trump. I like like Mike Pence. I'm not really a Mike Pence kind of guy. I can't see myself vote for Mike Pence. I'd vote for Mike Pence over the Hatib Khalib and all that. I mean, what an embarrassment. And Omar and all that. I mean, my God, what happened to this place? What happened to America? Ah! So, yes. I was watching the State of the Union on Tuesday night, but also keep up with what I do for a living, which is a handicap. But remember, the meat man is not a professional gambler. I am a professional handicapper. So, yes, I know Mac McClug is probably not going to play on Wednesday night. I like that. Ooh, wait a minute, hold on. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Ah, ah, what did you just say? You like that. No, Meat Man, what's going to happen is, is everybody that does a video and everybody who does this and that, they're all going to point, point to the why you're going to bet against Georgetown because Mac McClug's not going to be back in the start lineup. And, and what are you talking about, Meat Man? My God, what are you talking about? Ah, explain this to me. Mac McClug? I don't know anybody to take this the wrong way. He's a ball hog. <laughs> He's a ball hog. He shoots the ball way too much for the Georgetown Hoys. He shoots it way too much. His last full game, his last full game that, that, that Matt McClug played, he was 6 for 19 from the field and 0 for 4 from 3. Nobody wants to stand around and watch that. Nobody wants to stand around and watch that. Now, let me, let me, let me, let me ask you, did, did, did you know this? Did you know this? Let's see if you know this. Let's see if you know this. Let's, let's play a little game. You tried to tell me something. Didn't really work. Now I'm going to tell you something. Ah. Did Matt McClug play in the last game for the Georgetown Hoyas? No. Nah. No, he didn't play. You're never going to believe what happened in a tree of years. You want to take a stab? Yeah, they won the thing. Yeah, you know why? Because... Everybody out on the floor, instead of watching Matt McClug play, ah, they got to participate in the ball game. Ooh, see how that works? He misses two games in a row. I think George Howe's going to win two games in a row. I think the Hawks are going to win two games in a row. Look, this series between Seton Hall and George Town, the Hawks and the Pirates, home team always does good. The last six times these two teams have played, the home team's won all six, and it's covered. Five straight. I like this. The Georgetown Hoyas proved last time out they can win without Mac McClung. I think they can do it again. Meat Man thinks they can do it twice. I'm getting three points here. The home team always plays good in this series. Why not, Cap? Why not, Cap? Why not on Wednesday night put the Meat Man down?
I'm going to go to the Georgetown Hoyers, baby. They're getting three points at home. And that's the current line that Chris Bookmaker, where the line originates. All right, now, a couple of things real fast. Don't forget to beat this number one play of the day, $15 guaranteed to win. But I'm going to send you the next day's number one play absolutely free. We won three straight. Three straight. Meat Man went, went six and one two weeks ago. And last week was a total disaster. Two, five and one. Two and oh, already this week. Ah, look. Ten, six and one. The last 17. Not bad. Not bad, Cap. Not bad. Nobody wins a ball. And when you pick as many games as I do, you're going to have a couple of little loser streaks. But if you have a little money management and you make your bets the same way and you got a little bank, well, you always got to have about 20 big blinds, man. You ain't got 20, 30 big blinds. Just push all in and, and just forget about it. You have to have that big blind to stay alive in the game. The beat man's number one play for Wednesday's basketball against spread wagering action. $15 guaranteed to win. Or I'm going to give you Thursdays. The next day's number one play. Absolutely free. Text the word 1 O N E. To 94253, meet that takes Venmo, Cash App, PayPal. Want to pay with your debit, your credit card? I send the invoice right to email box. So meet that's number one play for Wednesday's basketball against spread wagering action. $15 guaranteed to win. I'm going to send you Thursday's number one play absolutely free. Takes the word one. O N E to 94253. All right, that's going to wrap it up for this edition. Of our meat bands, YouTube Sports Against the Spread pickup show. Now, YouTube video ends, but the party continues, Cap. I sent out a text message. I'm going to send out a text message, Pink, the next nine nights. I, I, if I go over the total with the text message thing, I'm just going to pay for it. I ain't worried about it. The next nine straight nights, the meat band is going to text out a premium play. Want to get it? If you're already on the list, you're good. You only got to opt in one time. You're on for life. You can opt out at any time. You'll never get another text message from the meat man ever again. When you put the phone number, you type in 94253. When you put the text message, you're going to put my nickname to get the meat man's free print pick text message. Put meat man, M-E-A-T-M-A-N. It's really easy. Now, how do you know you did it right? You're going to get a reply welcoming text. And on that reply welcoming text, it's going to be a 702 phone number. You're going to get a phone call by the exact same 702 phone number. That's my man, Rich. Rich is going to call and confirm you're 21 years old. He's going to call and confirm it was you that opted into the meat man's free prefix text message list. And yeah, he might try to say that number one play, $15. You're not obligated to buy anything for the meat man. Answer the phone, be nice to Rich, confirm it was you that opted in, listen to the sales pitch, confirm you're 21 years old. And away you go. You want to see a picture of Rich? Just go to the homepage of my website, meatandpotatoes.com. Rich is one of the handicappers up there. You only got to opt in one time to get on the meat man's free pre big text message list. You can opt out at any time, and I will never send you another text message ever again. It's a complimentary service. All of us, everybody that watches my YouTube videos. But you have to opt in. The way you do it, you text the word meat man. My nickname, M-E-A-T-M-A-N. To nine four two five three.